What's up ladies and gents, it's your girl Amanda and I'm coming back to y'all with yet another mukbang and I'm trying to slide up closer to the table. <laughs> so you guys, this is going to be a different kind of mukbang. It's a no meat mukbang, okay? I've actually done one a couple of days ago. It was like a stir fry mukbang. Um, so I am not eating any meat and as you can see, here is my plate. Had to take a um, thumbnail picture. So what I got today, I got a sweet potato. I got broccoli, cauliflower, and carrots up under there. And I got a um, vegetable kebab. I got these from Kroger. It has tomatoes, zucchini, um, bell pepper, onion, squash. And so this is what I'm eating today. It's kind of different. From the normal mukbangs, y'all know y'all love the mukbangs with the um, seafood, those are popular, which I am going to do one, seriously y'all, <laughs> I am going to do one, um, y'all like the fast foods and quite honestly y'all, I don't eat fast food every day, I won't eat fast food every day, and that's just, gonna, I'm just going to be honest with you, I can't imagine myself eating fast food every day. Um, or eating heavy food every day. It will definitely F up with my stomach. Excuse me, y'all. I was about to curse. I'm trying to be, uh, you know, a little kid friendly, or you know what I'm saying? Even though my child is not here, she's still at church. Um, I already recorded a video right before this. And so now I'm just eating. Um, so yeah, she's at church and I, and I don't curse around her, but usually sometimes if I'm by myself, a curse word will slip out. So, please forgive me if I curse just maybe once or twice, it's, it's a slip up, okay? Um, but yeah, she's at church. She goes to a local church here. And, um... They just started back, actually. And so, she's been dying to get up there, honey. And, um, so she goes every Wednesday, so. Mm-hmm. I thought I had some napkins. Oh, yeah, I do. <laughs> um, so how's everybody doing today? Mm. Hope everybody's doing fine. And, yeah, if it looks kind of smoky in here, it probably is. <laughs> I got my fan on over there because it kind of got smoked up a little bit up in here <laughs> when I was cooking. But, hopefully the smoke didn't die now because it was a little heavier. The smoke was a little heavier in here. But, yeah, y'all, yeah, I'm trying... I'm going to try to do other mukbangs, but like I said, I'm not going to do a lot of fast food mukbangs. I'm going to do whatever I want to do. You know, it's, 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 you know, you, you like it or you don't feel like that. But I can't, I can't eat heavy food like that because I do, I will get sick. I can't eat fast food every day because I will definitely get sick. I can't eat heavy food every day. Now, I'll do the fast food every once in a while. I try to go to different places every time I go, you know what I'm saying? So. Mm. I think my next one, I'm going to do a shrimp, a shrimp and a crab mukbang. I think that's the next one I'm going to do. I'm going to do like a seafood boil. So, that'll be my next one. So. I think I'm gonna get the um the king crab and as y'all know king crabs are high as hell okay I mean they're high as hell so um in order to to make it count and make it worth it I'm gonna have to at least get four of them bad boys okay I know that's gonna be over a hundred dollars off the rip so but I don't know if Lauren's gonna eat it because I don't I don't even know if Lauren 
actually like. I don't even know if she had crab before. I, I can't imagine her liking it. I don't know. I'm not going to do, do away with just having two of them. So, let me see. Mmm. Y'all, this is so good. It's simple, but it's so good. I mean, I cooked it myself. I just put some spices and some seasoning. Um, what did I put on here? I put um, onion vegetables. I put garlic powder, curry, pink Himalayan salt, and some of the um, Mrs. Dash, but I got the Kroger brand this time. Um, I think that's all I put on here. So, but it's good. Got my Kroger water. Because that's why I shop at. Two places I shop at. Kroger and Publix. And every once in a while, I'll go to Trader Joe's and Aldi. And I wish, but see, Trader Joe's and Aldi is on the other side of town. And if I'm not over there, I'm not going. I would love for them to put one on this side of town, but... Because I love Trader Joe's. I love Aldi. And people being slick, hating on Aldi. So I'm like, oh, they got off-name brand stuff. But that stuff be good, for real. Especially they little pizzas. Tastes just like DiGiorno, for real. Mmm. It's so good. Mmm, 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 mmm. Mm. And I love me some sweet potatoes, y'all. I love me some sweet potatoes. I don't have any cinnamon here, but I do love mine with cinnamon, a little sugar, and butter. But I only put butter in this one. I didn't really want sugar, if that makes sense. Mmm. <laughs> And y'all make sure y'all go see my my taste test video, my latest taste test video. Um, I taste tested the the new Lay's, the everything bagel, the crispy taco, and fried green tomatoes. So make sure y'all check out that video. It's currently up in the playlist, so check that out after you look at all my other mukbang videos, honey. Okay. So good. So what are y'all favorite vegetables? And do y'all go without meat sometimes? Do y'all do meatless? What they call it? Meatless Mondays? <laughs> I go. I can go days without eating meat. I actually did a, a, a meat a no meat challenge. So it's doable. It's doable. Mmm. So. My favorite vegetables, I eat all the vegetables, really. I don't have one particular favorite. But I will say, a good combo to go with the, um, to go with the, um, sweet potatoes, broccoli. I love broccoli and sweet potatoes together. Um, it's just, it's just a good old combination, for real. A great combination, just love it. <laughs> Love it. Because I was at work and I was like, what am I going to eat today? Because, y'all, my job, I swear my job has got to be the most laid back job anyone could ever have. I get paid decent amount of money just to sit there all day. I even asked them, can y'all find me something else to do? You know, I want more work. But we don't have anything for you at this time. What? I'll be bored sometimes. <laughs> I 
And y'all ain't see, if I get a job that doing my work, I'm gonna be complaining. Mm hmm Y'all ain't see it. It's quiet. That's how I be when I child. I be dead up quiet. But it's gonna be quiet when you get here too because she actually has um she actually has to study for like two tests and she has some homework to do. So she's gonna be busy, busy, busy. When she gets there. <laughs> she's in middle school now, honey. She's not in elementary no more. You feel me? You gotta do what you got to do, boo. Yeah, I got my computer right here. And, um... But, yeah, um... Yeah, I'm, I was on my computer. I got Facebook up. Yeah, I don't know how Facebook is. <clears throat> but, um. First rule is my entertainment. Um. Um. Facebook is my entertainment th throughout the day. I get a kick out of Facebook. I get a kick out of things that go on Facebook. Um, I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't, me personally, I don't put my personal life on Facebook. I could be in a relationship and no one would know. <laughs> I'm not in one now, but I'm just saying, I don't, don't put my business on Facebook. But, however, if anybody else put their business on Facebook, I mind my business, I buy, I mind my own business being nosy. Okay. I don't make no comment up under it. I'm just looking at the comment. Girl, I, am I the only person that do that? Am I, only, am I the only person that minds their own business being nosy? There's nothing wrong with it. I don't know why you. There's always drama on the book, okay? I'm here for it. I am here for it. I just don't get myself involved all up in the drama. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. I'm all for it, sunsies. Oh, that sweet potato is so good. And yeah, I put butter in it. And yeah, I use the real butter. Okay? I don't use that fake crap. It has to be the real butter. It has to say real butter on the um, container. I don't use no margarine. I don't use that, uh, what's it called? Country crock. I can't believe it's not butter. I don't use that stuff. I use the real dill, okay? And if we don't say real butter, I can't do it. It's not gonna be good. Like, how are you gonna get, how, like for instance, how are you gonna bake a cake with margarine? You can't do it. You gotta buy the real thing. You gotta buy the real butter. And that's what I do. I don't care how much real butter costs. It can be like five dollars or whatever. I'm gonna buy the real butter. It's just certain stuff that you just have to buy the real thing. Okay. So I I'm and me personally. I'm not really big on, um, you know, like, names. Like, I'll buy the off-name brand Doritos. Some people just ain't gonna buy that. I buy off-name brand toilet tissue. Some people gotta buy, um, Angel Sock. I ain't like that. You feel me? But, the one thing I got to buy the real thing of is books. So what's some real things? What's some of the things that you you got to get the brand on? Like I know some people got to buy um sunbeam bread. I get Kroger brand. <laughs> I get the Publix brand. It don't matter to me, you know what 
So let me know what are some of the brand names that you got to buy the brand name. And it can't be the off brand. Like my sister. She has to she has to buy bounty. Pepper towels. I get the Dollar Tree kind. Don't make me know. Shoot, I buy Dollar Tree toilet seat. You. It's going down the toilet. It's getting flush down the damn toilet. It doesn't matter. <laughs> but <laughs> my butter. It's got to be the real thing. It's got to be. <laughs> mm. Mm, 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 mm. That onion was good. For real. That onion was real good. And um, like I said, I did the taste test. And yeah, I love these the, the tacos. I'm about to get some of these little tacos. I actually with then we'll put the taco seasoning on the kettle cook kind. See? These were kettle cooked, the everything bagel. And they were okay. But. I mean, I don't know. They should have put the kettle cook onto that. That was a bomb. And then the fried green tomatoes to me. I don't know y'all. Tastes like mayonnaise to me. Tastes like I just had like a chip with mayonnaise on. I don't know. Maybe my taste buds ain't wrong. Cause I love fried green tomatoes. Oh, that way. I love some fried green tomatoes. Mm -hmm. I'm going four though. Let me tell you that much. I'm a snacky shack over here. Enough with that. I'll tell y'all. If y'all haven't tried the PB and J Oreos, these are actually pretty good. I tried them already. They are lovely. And I think they would taste really good with some vanilla ice cream. I really enjoyed them. Mmm. <laughs> that was delicious. And I think... I don't know. These everything bagels, they'd probably be good with like some a sandwich or something. I'm not, I'm not too fond of the fried green tomatoes. Okay. But you gotta watch my taste test video in order to see what I thought about them. Right? Right. But, um, let's cut that off. Um, that actually filled me up for now. <laughs> now I'm just joking. Um, I try not to eat after a certain time. Um, because I usually I'm in the bed by a certain time. <laughs> I go to bed at all four hours, y'all, yeah, like, for real. I go to bed at all four hours. Sometimes I'm in the bed before 10 o'clock. I shower up. 
she get ready for bed and that's how it be and y'all i hope y'all enjoyed this video um so yeah so y'all know what y'all gotta do tell a friend to tell a friend to tell other friends to watch my videos and to come back and watch my mukbangs okay Usually I'm doing a mukbang with Lauren and it's a little litter uh, with my child because, you know, she conk with it. But, um, yeah. So, y'all stay tuned for the next mukbang. I don't know if I'll do one tomorrow. We shall see. We may do one tomorrow. I don't know. It all depends on if I want to do one. <laughs> Anyway, if y'all new to my channel, make sure you subscribe to my channel so you can see more videos like this. And y'all stay tuned for the next video. Alrighty.